Towns today is taking us to the capital city. Hartford, of course, is known as the insurance capital of the world. But did you know there is more than one claim to fame there? Yeah, Hartford is home to the oldest continuously operating public art museum. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Cologne gives us a special look inside the Wadsworth. This Hartford icon is hard to miss, and once you go inside, you step into a timeline of historical memories that takes you back to the 1840s. Hartford needed a destination, a destination for art and culture, and he was fortunate enough to have known some of the right people who were also connected to the art world. That man and founder was Daniel Wadsworth. The Hartford native opened this museum, and curator Aaron Monroe tells me that throughout the years they have remained open, whereas other institutions had some periods of closure, which is why the Wadsworth claims the title of the oldest continuously operating public art museum in the country. Built on the site where George Washington came through Hartford several times, and there's commemorative plaques out there to think about. But more recently, in, in thinking of our early modern era, Salvador Dali spent time here. These giant halls are decorated with remarkable paintings, ancient jewels, and even this lion sign that once alerted people traveling by stagecoach in Hartford to stop by and grab a bite. What do we have here? Okay, so some of the surprising Hartford connections that you can see include what uh, is called a tavern sign. This is really uh, uh, an incredible form of marketing in the 1800s. These halls are packed with the past, but the museum is also one to catch up with the times. Monroe says they are working to diversify the stories they tell by featuring artists that have been hidden in the shadows. And there are so many new artists that are helping us make sense and, and have dialogue around some challenging issues, whether it's race, gender, class. Another way is by highlighting Hartford's native artists and its people, like how photographer Dewad Bay did in this portrait of a Hartford black resident. He was addressing really a deficiency in historical portraiture, which was typically people of wealth and people that were white. From the famous Charter Oak Tree painting that is also displayed here to getting a glimpse of the toothpick cube, the Wadsworth Museum will take you on an unforgettable adventure through time. Christian Colon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.